The first writing I did that I really began to uh, conceive of myself as, as being a writer, a person who loves words and loves to play with words, was poetry. I think many people start with poetry. I was in high school and I was scribbling poetry when I was supposed to be listening to the teacher and thinking about it. And, and it was the thing that sort of held me together, I think, uh, gave me an inner self. So poetry was really the foundation of my writing life. And in a way, writing children's books is very similar because you're choosing words carefully and you're saying things sometimes very sparsely, but you're hoping to get a lot more across than, than just the words themselves. There's a lot of feeling and a lot of sensual detail and poetry still feeds my inspiration for writing my children's books. I don't think there's a writer in the world that doesn't procrastinate when they write and it's so fun because everything seems so desirable to do instead of what you have to do which is sit down and start work. So when I was in Manhattan and I used to walk to an office I would look at every window on the way and sit on the park benches and now way out in the country I usually find a way to play with the dogs, make a third cup of tea or step outside but eventually I get pulled back to my work and then there's then I don't look up for a few hours.